miss the snowstorm today. The dedicated city crews bravely battled the elements, working hard to clear the streets. They promptly issued the 14-hour snow emergency due to the heavy snowfall. This morning, city crews had cleared all emergency routes by 8 a.m. They even put down a sand mixture at main intersections to help prevent ice and slick conditions. Many people were even shoveling snow and clearing off the sidewalks, and the city was very satisfied with the crews. We had all our equipment ready to go, and um, the personnel did a great job of getting out there and getting on top of it as best we could once it really started to come down. The city is hoping with the warmer temperatures, the melting will help crews with their workload. And North Platte residents woke up Friday morning with well over 15 inches, closer to 20 inches of snow. Some Rant Sandridge apartment residents had a difficult time getting out. KMOP News 2's Ashanti Allen has the story. I spoke with one resident who was on her way to work. At least she thought a neighbor stopped by to help her, but couldn't manage to get her out of the parking stall. Lydia Couch was determined. She backed out, pulled in, had a neighbor attempt to push her out, turned her wheel and added some gas, but all that hard work was not enough to get out of the snow. Well, I'm going to have to not go to work today. As you can see, I just got stuck um, just trying to get out of my driveway. I tried to we tried to dig us out with no success. Couch said all this snow was a surprise. I was not expecting this much snow. The last I heard it was supposed to only be three inches. And then I woke up this morning and it's like 15. Couch is an employee at the public library. I'm just one of the part timers and they do need me there, but it's at the same time, it's too dangerous to go out. That was the same sentiment shared with many across the community as this will be a snowstorm to remember. In North Platte, Ashanti Allen, KNOP News 2. Snow around, this caused a lot of people to get their gloves and jackets on and get to digging. This 